up you guys time is back with another pour up or pour out this is a battle this is a first impressions video this is all of that but before we get into that just want to say thank you guys again it is an honor to be playing on one of those electronic devices whether it's that cell phone that tablet that laptop that macintosh that brand new big screen tv whether you watch me at home at work on playing a train or an automobile maybe you watch me right now in the grocery store ready to make a tough decision on one of these products and if you guys are at the end of this video hopefully it'll be before you get out of that store you will be able to make that decision now before we get into this again we are closing in on the 5,000 subscriber mark once we get there again we do fragrances we do mint's grooming we do beverages we do eating we do all of it okay now i decided to put this one into my fragrance uh, uh youtube channel because it seems like you know you guys will actually watch it when it's on there rather than on its own thing so this is the beverage edition the pour up or pour out now as you guys may know about a week ago pepsi made a tough decision they finally killed off the sierra mist which was their competition or was their sprite if you will Sprite is the king of the lemon lime soda, followed probably by 7-Up, and honestly, 7-Up is probably only king because, you know, when you think about having a sore, upset stomach, first thing I remembered as a kid was mama telling you to get some 7-Up. Now it's just get white soda, get white soda. I don't even know why they call Sprite white soda, 7-Up white soda. It's clear, call it clear soda. <sighs> But anyways, when you had a upset stomach, you went for the salt and crackers, you went for the Sierra Mist, the Sprite, maybe you went up for the 7-Up, maybe you went for the cheap store brand lemon lime soda, but Pepsi had their own, the Sierra Mist, which I believe came out maybe like 20-something years ago, and honestly, here's the thing, when it comes to soda, I'll drink Sprite occasionally, or lemon lime soda, if you will, but, you know, when I really want a soda, soda, Sierra Mist Sprite Clear Soda, lemon lime soda is probably the last uh, flavor I reach for. You know, usually you want that cola, you want that stuff with that little bit of spice in there, you want some of that, maybe you want some of root beer, maybe you want some of that Dr. Pepper, something that wows you, some orange soda, maybe you get some grape, maybe you get that Mountain Dew, Mountain Dew is very good as well. Uh, but yeah, I don't, really don't drink soda as much uh, anymore than I, than I did when I was a kid. But anyways, I think Sprite is pretty much so popular because they got all the athletes that sponsor their stuff. And Sierra Mist, like who 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 was their sponsor besides just Pepsi? Was there some famous iconic celebrity that drank Sierra Mist? Who knows? But they finally decided to cut off Sierra Mist. Sierra Mist is no more. And they decided to go with this new lemon lime soda. Starry, starry, starry. Here's the thing, though. Another thing, man. Maybe they got to think of a different name, okay? Because, I mean, Sierra Mist sounds good. Pepsi sounds good. But they think about this, too. Uh, another reason why Coke sounds good, Sprite, okay? When you go to a bar or something like that, right? You say vodka and Sprite. Vodka, Sprite, cranberry. It sounds cool. I would say vodka, Sierra Mist, and cranberry. It doesn't sound good. Vodka, starry. You don't do that. Okay? You don't say Sprite. And then when it comes to the darker alcohols, the bourbons, the whiskeys, you say whiskey and Coke, Jack and Coke. You don't say Jack and Pepsi. Even if they do, even if the establishment does have Pepsi, they will just be okay with you saying Coke. Now, they probably will ask you, is Pepsi okay? Because there are some people really out there that are super anal about Coke or Pepsi. Me, personally, I like both. If I had to choose, I'm going to choose Pepsi, but I'm not one of those people that, oh my God, you don't have Coke, so I got to leave. No, I'm not like that, so I'll still take whatever is in front of me. But Starry versus the Sprite, the battle of the lemon-lime soda. Now, here's the thing. When I drink these as well, I usually don't even get that lemon-lime flavor. I just get this weird, yeah, okay, okay, maybe you do get some kind of citrus in there, but the citrusy just honestly, like, sells her water with like sugar that's all i get so uh let's go with the starry first see if there's any changes that i can tell now again i can't go based off of their sierra mist because i don't have a sierra mist in front of me but i can kind of tell if it's somewhat different now you know before we get into that one more thing one thing i want to show you though too is you know apparently sierra mist had real sugar 
and now they're going back to the high fructose corn syrup maybe people just like the corn syrup a little bit better even though it's not good for you eh, sugar's not good for you neither but maybe people just like the flavor of that fructose syrup but here's where they kind of differ though okay everything is just about the same 230 calories 240 okay this one has 63 grams of sugar this one has 65 grams of sugar but where they differ is the sodium intake which is weird it's almost double this is 110 and this is only 55 so when I hear that I'm thinking this although it has um, and it has more sugars now from what I've read someone said they think the sprite was actually sweeter than this but who knows maybe it's that salt that extra added salt that's kind of making it I don't know come off sweet who knows but let's try this first starry star of the show right here here we go starry down the hatch Ooh. Ooh. although you can tell Ooh. I like it and not even trying the Sprite yet. I mean, if you guys really want that lemony, limey flavor, this has a really good lemon lime flavor, which I'm actually digging a lot. It's You can tell it's not, it almost kind of tastes like it's natural, even though it probably isn't. It's probably artificial flavoring. But this is a very, very good lemon lime soda. Again, I'm not the biggest lemon lime soda fan. I think it's just okay. This one has that nice, crisp, refreshing. Wow, I'm digging that one. Starry, man. The Sierra Mist, if this is the new Sierra Mist, even though it's got its own name, but if this is supposed to be the uh, conqueror of the Sierra Mist, I think it's did a good job. I, I don't remember Sierra Mist tasting that good, but this is pretty good. Let's try the Sprite. Maybe the wife will try some Starry, see what she thinks off to the side. She just woke up, so I don't know if she'll come all the way on camera, but there she is. She'll put her hand in there. Here's the Sprite. Sprite. That's not even close. The Sprite... The starry actually tastes like it has the mixture of two, the lemon and lime, okay? You get kind of like it, now again, it's not like tasting a raw lime or raw lemon in your mouth. But it does taste like, again, it probably has that artificial flavoring, but it does have a nice, decent mixture of the two, that lemon, that lime, that nice tart, that sour, nice sweet. Um, now, yeah, it does. I think the sweetener in here is pretty nice too, even though it is the fructose corn syrup. They used to have real sugar. Again, both are probably bad for you. Uh, so it's not like, you know, I'm going to hype up one just to downgrade the other. But I think this is better than the Sprite. I'm going to let the wife try the Sprite next. I think this, now the problem with this is it has a weird name. Sprite just has a cool, Sprite just has a cool name, okay? But I'm not. Like it tastes flat right away, even though it's not flat, but it, you know, it has a flat taste. Mm. I'm not trying to be prisoner of the moment here, mm. but I think this is the better option. This one tastes better in my opinion. Is this a new brand? It's, or is uh, it they're getting rid of Sierra Mist. Oh. This is the new Sierra Mist. This is Starry Mist. I think this is better. Hold on. Let me try one more time. Honestly, it's more refreshing too. It's not as, um, it doesn't sting as much neither. Uh, the Sprite kind of stings a little bit. Sprite doesn't sting that much like a like a Coke or anything like that. It doesn't sting like that. But that's good. Um, Sprite is a classic, but that Starry is something new. It's good. Yeah, and and here's the thing with sodas too, is that sometimes. You get that one bottle of Sprite that tastes so good, and then the next one kind of tastes a little off. Maybe this could be the occasion where this Sprite, it's good, but it doesn't, it just, to me, it doesn't seem like it has the same zing, the same pop, that same 
refreshing, that same quest, that quench, uh, quenching, if you will. Yeah, I'm going to have to give it up to the Starry Night. I think this tastes much better. This is just okay, in my opinion. Again, I'm probably not going to go for either one. Again, if I'm going to drink a soda, I want Coke. I want Dr. Pepper. I want that root beer. I want something extravagant. I want something that's different. I want that orange soda, that grape, that strawberry soda. Lemon lime sodas, these are just good for stomach aches. And maybe the occasional you just grab a Sprite while you're eating some lunch or some kind of McDonald's item. You just grab a Sprite. But again, it wouldn't be something I would go just grab. But if I did, and we're talking about not just having a stomach ache, I'm going to go for this one. It tastes good. Honestly, I kind of like the fact. I think this tastes better than the Sierra Mist 2. I kind of like the fact that maybe they went back to the fructose syrup. Now, again, it's all bad for you, okay? But, but if you kind of drink it in moderation, like a couple sips here and there, maybe you should be okay. Uh, this one's got the fructose syrup too. And I thought this one tasted a little bit sweeter, even though this, uh, the sugars on this was like about, I think it was like two grams more. But then again, I think where this messes up is the sodium. I think the sodium takes away that flavor. That's where I thought this one was gonna win because there is a, a half, half the amount of sodium in this one, okay? This is 110, the star is only 55, and I think that's what helps that sweetener come out a little bit more, so. With that being said, I'm gonna get up out of here. Starry is the new king of the lemon lime soda, in my opinion. Now, maybe they'll add some kind of, ooh, maybe Starry Mountain Dew. Maybe a mixture of that, which I don't think you can do because Mountain Dew's already kind of got that citrusy uh, taste, so I don't know if they would do that. But maybe do like a cranberry Starry, maybe a cherry Starry, cherry vanilla Starry, who knows? But uh, Sprite has all those different flavors already. But I think Starry is just coming out. Again, not that many people know about it. But if you see this in the gas station, give it a shot. I think you'll like it. Starry is the winner. So with that being said, I'm going to get up out of here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. And if you guys did, hit the likes, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Peace. Yeah.